Hello everybody, I am just Lance and I am absolutely thrilled to bring you another video. It's here. Anyways, this is the razor I ordered from Etsy. It came today. So I went ahead and I've been patiently waiting to do the unboxing. And so we're going to do it. I ordered this razor off of Etsy from a store called OS Sprocket. And this is a razor that I have been wanting in my collection for quite some time. He taped it well, I'll give him that. bubble wrap oh I love that stuff or a big bubble and here it is looks like the razor there um, when I got it I wiped the box down with Clorox wipes because I know that the time it's been in the mail that you know any viruses would be pretty much dead Got this nice gold case. It's actually black. Oh, it's black? Black mm -hmm. case there? Okay, it's a black case. And there we go. The razor is a 1905 Gillette single ring. Guys, check it out. Let's see here. This is their traveler set. Got the nice padding up there. A felt. A felt. Got these canisters. Okay. One's for a brush and one's for soap. I guess this is for the soap puck. I'm not sure. He said there was some patina on the inside of the cases. This is gold, right, dear? No. Yes. No. Maybe the lighting. Yeah, I know it is. Anyways, one is for a brush. I imagine this skinnier one is probably for soap. It's got some patina in there. Unfortunately, it doesn't have the original brush. That now I've been oh. Pack of blades. What blades are those, dear? Gillette blue. Gillette blue blades? Mm -hmm. Ooh, these are vintage. Mm -hmm. There it is. It's an open comb, old type razor. It's not gold. Oh, uh, it's silver? I guess. And screw the bottom here like a two-piece and that comes out then the cap comes out like so look at that guys how's the plating on that babe okay got your stabilizer pins here just a beautiful Beautiful razor. Yeah, it's silver. Beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. Teeth. They all feel nice and straight. This razor is from 1905. The cap is beautiful. The, the razor is from 1905. In this case, it's from 1908. That's in good shape. Stick it back up in there. 
From what I understand, these cases normally came in black or Karakin red. And uh, more exotic colors was like gold. Very, very nice. Very nice. And why is it called a single ring? I'll show you that here in a sec. Single ring is the second model that Gillette made, and it has one single ring here. The double ring had two. Is there any cracks in that handle, babe? Turn it. Turn it. One. Small? Mm, medium. Medium? Yep. Yeah. Which cracks in the handle were not uncommon to find one. But it's not split. This is a beautiful shape. Nice handle. Nice weight to the razor. Let's check out the inside of the case. It's purple felt. Go ahead and take a peek in there, babe, with the camera. It's in good shape. <laughs> Oops. Hmm. Don't smell too musty. That's a good thing. Gillette symbol's clear. Nice. In this angle, it looks gold. Very strange. Blades fit right in like so. And there was another piece of fire fingers. Where? On the, on the tray. Paper on the tray. What's this paper say? It's a booklet. It's got the booklet. Turn it around. Nice. No, I mean. Oh, like so? There you go. What's the booklet say, babe? It says, known the world over Gillette, New York, Boston, Montreal, London, Berlin, Paris. Offices and factories. And like I said, this is the Canadian set. Definitely, definitely very, very happy to have this in my collection. It's definitely going to be a centerpiece razor. It's like an old camera case. You see what's on the back? No, nothing. No markings, just really good shaped black leather. Sure, nothing shifted. No, nothing shifted. From what I understand, uh, Gillette, when mm -hmm. he came, he went ahead. He was uh, well. Gillette was a door was a door to a traveling salesman, and when he came up with the idea for the Gillette company, and of course since he traveled a lot, normal that he would go ahead and come up with a set like this a traveler set go ahead and give people the opportunity to just throw their barber shop in a pocket so to speak into the bottom of their shopping or travel bag and go but that's in gorgeous condition but yeah there it is guys the 1905 Gillette single ring and a 1908 traveler case the razor like I said is Canadian oh let's see if it's got a Canadian marking on it marking on it real quick <clears throat> Does that say made in Canada there, dear? Turn it over, just flip it completely over. Move your fingers, move these fingers. Here, I got it. No, I can't see it. Yes. Made in Canada. Mm -hmm. You put a shadow on it. I couldn't see light on it. Anyways, so that's the razor, guys. Um, hope you all are doing well. I'll go ahead and I'll get this video uploaded. You and... see the case fully loaded with everything? Oh, yeah. Case fully loaded with everything. That's where the blade box would go? Yeah, the blade box goes here and over here. Razor 
Canisters. He's just got the razor in the middle, canisters on each side, one for soap, one for a brush. Now all I gotta do is find the brush that goes with it, and I will have a gem of a a gem of a set, which this is definitely a gem of a set as it is. But it's not gem, it's Gillette. Exactly. <laughs> Anyways, I hope y'all are doing well. Um thank you all for tuning in. Uh stay safe. Uh, don't try and go stir crazy from being inside so much. And I will see all of you in the next video. Or nope. And on the flip side of the blade. Bye bye now. Hey guys, I just wanted to do this quick little update here at the end. Anyways, my girlfriend was noticing down here on the smooth band. It has the word Gillette. The G looks like it rubbed off. So it says Gillette without the G. But it has P-A-T for patent space mar for march space 705 so that tells me that the razor was manufactured march 7th or was patented march 7th of 1905 and uh real quick i'm gonna be looking for a bodyguard to watch my back because me and my girlfriend we were talking the other night and we was talking about my razor collection and she said, you know, when you pass away, I want the single ring set that way. So because, you know, your son's going to get the rest, but I'd like to have something really antique. -y. So, you know, I'm going to need somebody to watch my back so she don't take me out. Anyways, I'll talk to y'all later and see you on the flip side of the blade. Bye bye now.